AI is dramatically transforming every industry and software engineering is no exception. But the idea that software engineers will soon be replaced is too far-fetched. I keep getting questions about this and my answer has always been the same. You'll be fine. See, adopting AI is not just about automating workflows, but also about enabling software engineers to tackle challenges that were previously considered impossible. With advancement in machine learning, natural language processing, and predictive analytics, you can leverage AI to do so much more. And to that end, here are eight ways you can and should leverage AI to become an even better software engineer. Hey folks, my name is Utsav. I'm a software engineer based in Seattle with over 15 years of experience in both big tech and startups. My goal with this channel is to provide mentorship to help you excel in your software engineering career. If that sounds interesting, consider subscribing and connect with me on Instagram, LinkedIn, or any other social media platform where I'll be happy to answer your questions directly. One of the most common ways to use AI to improve your software engineering process is through code generation and completion. And I'm sure most of you are already doing this and agree that this drastically reduces the time you spend writing repetitive code, letting you focus on the more creative and challenging aspects of software engineering. Popular tools like Copilot, Cursor, Tab9, and Code Whisperer have made this process pretty seamless. These tools integrate directly to your ID and use AI to analyze the context of your code. And based on that, um, or what you're working on, they provide intelligent suggestions, whether completing a function, generating boilerplate code, or even helping create API integrations. For example, if you're building an application and need to create uh, some standard database models or write the same API endpoints repeatedly, these tools can handle that for you. But while these tools are powerful, they're not perfect. The code they generate requires your oversight to ensure that it's accurate, secure, and aligns with your project specific needs. AI might misunderstand your intent or suggest something that looks correct but doesn't fully work in context. Another issue is that they sometimes lose historical context. So if you use them incrementally, they may overwrite or modify what you had previously generated. So it's always a good idea to have your projects on version control if you intend to rely on AI for code generation. But more importantly, consider these tools as coding assistance and not full replacements. However, when used effectively, code generation and completion can significantly impact your productivity. By automating the mundane parts of development, you can dedicate more time to solving complex problems and building innovative solutions. Of course, writing code means you'll also need to eventually debug it. Debugging and error detection are some of the most time-consuming parts of software development. But AI is making this process faster and more efficient. The value here is clear. It speeds up debugging and reduces the chance of human error, helping you deliver high-quality code in less time. Tools like DeepCode, SNCC, and SonarCube lead in this space. These tools use AI to scan your code for vulnerabilities, syntax errors, and logic flaws. They go beyond just simple linting by deeply analyzing your code base and identifying issues that you might have otherwise missed. For example, if a dependency has a potential security vulnerability or your logic has a subtle bug, these tools can flag it for you. They can also suggest fixes, saving you effort of digging through documentation or stack traces. This improves your code quality and helps you adopt better security practices, ensuring your applications are safe for your users. That way, you can ship features faster and more confidently by reducing the time it takes to identify and resolve critical bugs. Debugging is still a reactive process. What's even better is being able to predict what's about to go wrong before it actually does. That's where predictive analysis becomes a game changer, mainly in project management. Identifying risks early increases the likelihood of project success, allowing you to address them before they become significant issues. Tools like Pluralsight Flow, Linear B, Jellyfish, and IBM's Engineering Insights are designed to help you make better decisions. These tools analyze your project data, such as team performance metrics, code commits, and task completion rates to predict outcomes and flag potential bottlenecks. For example, predictive analytics can help you plan sprints more effectively by showing you how long specific tasks are likely to take based on historical data. It can also assist in estimating costs and managing deadlines, ensuring that your projects stay on track and within budget. But that being said, predictive analytics relies heavily on 
on high quality historical data. So if your data is incomplete or inconsistent, the predictions may be inaccurate, leading to poor decisions. So if you decide to use them, make sure that you have high quality historical data to start with. Despite this limitation though, AI-driven analytics allows you to move from reactive problem solving to proactive planning, which is a huge advantage in today's fast-paced development environment. Another area where AI is transforming how teams work is prototyping. AI-driven prototyping helps teams visualize designs quickly, gather feedback, and settle on a vision early, reducing the risk of costly changes later in the development cycle. It also enables non-designers or people without coding experience to contribute to the creative process, fostering better communication. One platform I recommend for this is Lovable, who have also kindly sponsored this video. Lovable is an AI-powered platform that enables you to create full-stack web applications without any coding expertise by simply describing what you want in plain English. Since most of you are quite technical in coding, the no-code part may not be that interesting. However, this platform is still incredibly useful for prototyping. I've been working on a few side projects lately and I use Lovable to create the waitlist and some landing page variations for my projects. I was able to go from a basic idea to fully working prototype in just minutes. If you're someone with a knack for design and no tools like Figma, it can be even more effective. You can use Lovable to effortlessly transform your Figma files into a fully functional app. The platform provides all the tools you need to create great websites, front-end apps, and full-stack web applications from within the browser. It includes AI coding tools, real-time collaboration, and project sharing to give you a head start on whatever app idea that you're working on. So yeah, if you have an idea that you want to materialize into a working project or just want to prototype a few variations of an app that you're already working on, definitely give Lovable a try. Visit lovable.dev slash utsav and you'll get double the credits when you sign up. Thanks to Lovable for sponsoring this video and helping me prototype a few of my own projects. Automated testing is another area where you can leverage AI to ensure software quality while saving time. This accelerates testing and improves the test coverage, ensuring that your software is more robust and reliable. Several tools exist in this space, including Testim, Apply Tools, and AI enhanced integrations with Selenium. These tools leverage AI to handle various types of testing, like functional, regression, performance, and UI testing. They can automatically create and execute test cases, reducing the risk of human error and freeing up your time for more critical tasks. For example, with automated testing, you can set up workflows to continuously check that new code doesn't break any existing functionality. Tools like Apply Tools even bring visual AI into the mix, ensuring that your application's user interface looks and behaves as expected across environments. While automated testing is incredibly useful, it's not without limitations. Setting up tests for custom scenarios or training the AI to understand your application's unique requirements may require some initial effort. However, once the framework is in place, these tools can save you a significant amount of time and effort on the long run. DevOps is another area where intelligent automation can drastically improve how software teams manage and deploy their applications. It streamlines the software delivery lifecycle, making it faster, more reliable, and less error prone. It also reduces downtime, enhances scalability, and frees up your team to focus on more strategic initiatives. Tools like Ansible, Harness, and IBM Watson AI Ops are designed precisely for this. They leverage AI to automate critical DevOps task, um, including continuous CI CD pipelines and log analysis. For example, these tools can automatically detect and fix issues in your development process and analyze logs to identify the root causes of system failures. It can also help predict potential deployment failures before they actually happen, allowing you to address issues proactively rather than reactively. Security is another area where you must be proactive in today's rapidly evolving threat landscape. With the help of AI, you can strengthen defenses against cyber attacks, helping your project stay a step ahead of malicious actors. Tools like Darktrace, CrowdStrike, and Palo Alto Network's AI integrations are at the forefront of this technology. These systems harness the power of AI to monitor user behavior, network traffic, and system activity. And by analyzing this data, they can identify anomalies uh, that might indicate potential threats, such as unauthorized access, unusual data transfers, or attempts to exploit vulnerabilities. One of AI's key benefits in security is its ability to mitigate risks proactively. For example, 
suppose an AI system detects suspicious activity. In that case, it can automatically trigger alerts, isolate affected systems, or neutralize threats in real time long before they escalate into full-blown security incidents. These tools protect sensitive data and give security teams the insights they need to make informed decisions. And by automating threat detection and response, AI can be part of your security strategy, allowing you to create a more resilient software environment and safeguard your users' trust. These are just eight areas where you can leverage AI to transform your software engineering process. But this is not by any means an exhaustive list. I didn't even cover other cool areas like natural language processing or reactive AI-based architectures in distributed systems. But regardless, the point I want to put across is that having access to so many cool AI tools and platforms is a good thing. It improves your efficiency and opens new possibilities for what software can achieve. Whether you're a seasoned developer or just starting, leveraging AI is no longer optional. And by the way, this was the final video of a three-part series that I made on AI's impact on software engineering in the first part. I talked about technical skills you need to thrive in an AI-assisted engineering area. In the second part, I talked about non-technical skills that will set you apart when AI can help with the technical side. So definitely check those videos out if you haven't already. And of course, this is the third and final part where I mention all of the ways that you can actually leverage AI to get even better at your job. And that's it for today. I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.